Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's been about almost two years since I've last recorded, so it's been a while. But I've got the urge to play some more games, and I got some time. Um, so we're going to try out this one. This one's Lawnmower Sim. Came out just today. A lot of the other YouTubers uh, probably got a head start on most of us because, you know, that's just what they do. But I played the demo. I uh, played the first two lawns, and the game is pretty sharp. There's a lot of bugs uh, going on as far as camera and all that stuff, and I was on the Discord telling them about it. Um, a lot of that stuff got fixed. Um, so we're going to jump in. We're going to start a career. I'm going to start from the first lawn. It doesn't matter if it was already in the demo. I uh, want to see if anything has changed. So we're going to go ahead and create a career. Uh, I want to skip the tutorials because I already know what's going on. Company name. Ah, company name. Let's name the company... Uh, Renovation Inc. Inc. All right, there we go. Renovation Inc. All right, company logo. Let's go to company logo. Uh, did they add any new ones? This is the one I used in the demo. Um, I think I want to use that one. I think I like that one. Now, can we change the color of that? Uh, it doesn't look like it. All right. Uh, edit player. I'm fine with what this the player name. Uh, we don't have a name for it. Renovate. Because that is who I am. For now, right? Uh, avatar. Oh, we can change this. This is cool. Um, I like, kind of like the standard guy. I'm fine with the standard guy. What, whoever he was. Let's go back. Yeah, let's go back. Alright, that's fine. Change the hat. Oh, we can change the hat color. Okay, this is where we can change our colors. I'm going to go with the orange. Uh, I don't like that orange. How about that orange? He kind of looks like... Orange is the new black, right? We're not. Let's not do that. Let's go with. What about gray? It doesn't even look like gray. What about that color? No. 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 Uh, no. That. No. Green. Nah. Red. I'm gonna stick with the orange. I think that's gonna be a cool color. Let's go with orange. Let's say confirm. All right. And change hat. Logo placement. Uh, front and back. What? Logo placement. Oh, I see. Front only. Wait, I wasn't done, man. Back only, no logo. Front only. We'll do front only. Okay. And then uniform colors. There we go. Primary color. Orange. I like it. And then secondary color. Let's go with black. I don't know. White? I mean, that's kind of clean, right? It's kind of an ugly color. I don't like that one either. Purple? What do you guys think? We can always change it later. I don't have to make anything too drastic. Let's try orange and green, because you know that's kind of like, you know, the colors of weeds, right? So let's keep that. Let's confirm that. Uh, and we're good, right? Except we can't change our logo color. It just sucks. Okay. But that's okay. Uh, confirm. Uh, start a company. Are you happy with your company setup? For right now, until we, you know, go bankrupt. Uh, I am going to play with this one only because it has a really uh, good turning radius and it mulches the grass. This one you have to dump it, so I don't want to worry about that. So we're going to go with this one. It's going to cost us $2,600. We're going to end up with $350 to go. All right. So we're going to go ahead and click on this one. Uh, we're going to put us on it and our only vehicle. Uh, all this information here, I'll explain. Completion target, that's how much they want the lawn done. So typically you get about 96% of it done. I mean, that's what it looks like. And they say their contract's over with. And there might be like a whole section you didn't mow. I don't like that. We're going to mow, mow the whole thing. Uh, contract type, general cut. Cut height, we're doing inches. I've set it to inches. Uh, it comes standard in metrics, which is this is going to be like five to six inches. Um, ground check, basically you walk into the yard and you try to find anything that you might mow over because you don't want to damage your lawnmower. So we're going to do that. And then it's recommended time of 26 minutes to cut it. Uh, this is your deck width and your current grass range. So right now we're going to cut about three inches off, uh, three to four inches actually. So let's go ahead and start the, the lawn mowing company adventure. All right, Innovation Inc. is open for business. Let's do this. Okay, here's our lawn. Very pretty. 
Oh, I see a garden gnome already out there in the gr in the grass. Cool. All right, let's go ahead and just click confirm. All right. So the first thing we want to do is we want to go and sprint around and pick up all these little things. All right. It looks like is motion blur on. Uh, it feels like it. Uh, vibration, camera sensitivity. Let's turn the sensitivity down. Um, it felt like motion blur was on. Motion blur is off. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, let's click confirm. It felt like it was on. Doesn't that feel weird? I know you, YouTube's going to screw that up. All right, let's do that. And... Three of five opt. I really don't like the way that the grass is reacting on here. I thought they... All right, here's another object over here. Let's grab it. And I heard a cow. I hope that cow is funny. All right, let's keep on going around here. I'm not seeing anything. It's going to be small, like a little ball or a golf ball or something. Oh, there's one right there. Dude, we're done. Okay. So now we're going to do is we're going to go get in our tractor, or our mower. And let's just press F. There we go. All right. Uh, you press Z to lift the deck up and down. Oh, I'm sorry, Q. Uh, e. Oh, did they change everything? So T. <laughs> Start the engine. You got to hold it in. All right, there we go. So T and I we'll throttle all the way up to 3,000 RPMs, and Q puts the deck down. Q puts the deck up, and then E and C lifts and lowers the height. Right. So we're gonna move forward here. I want to make sure all my. So yeah, the camera angle is the camera is backwards. So let's go ahead and fix the camera. Uh, so we want to invert the Y axis. So let's do that. Cut, confirm. There we go. So if I look up, I look up, I look down, I look down. Right. So and the mouse sensitivity is also too low. So let's do camera sensitivity up a little bit. Click confirm. All right. All right. All right. So if we go to map or click the wait um, information. For the job. Oh, we didn't. Uh, two and three quarters. That's fine. It'll tell us whether or not we did right. So we're gonna press C. We're gonna lower the deck, and we're gonna press E, and that turns it on. All right. So here we go. Hopefully, it's not too loud. I turned it down. I guess I'll find out. In the All right, guys, I, I fast forwarded that first section uh, only because I went back to look and went in editing and the lawnmower was freaking loud. Like you literally couldn't hear me talking. So I've turned down everything. Hopefully this is better. So like I was trying to say, I like to mow around the edges when I mow grass. So uh, what I did is I did two, as you guys saw, it was two quick sections around the perimeter of the yard trying not to hit any of the flowers, which we did hit, so I'm probably going to get penalized like $6 or something for that, which I'm okay with, but it, it's not good that we do that. We don't want to do that like every time. And then I'm going to make a couple of swipes around this, and then we'll go do that little island right there, and then I think there's another one over there. So we'll get these. Like I said, I'm going to try to cut these squared off. Wait, look makes it a little bit easier in a little bit. So I got that one. I'm good with this one. So we're going to move to the next one. I'm just going to make a straight line across to it. Go around it. Oh, there. I overloaded my engine. We don't want to do that. So we got to watch that. It's hard to watch that because it's kind of like off. Oh, jeez. I don't want... Oh, I just cut it down. Heck on it. I, I freaking cut that plant. The plants are planted really close on this one. Even though this one, the difficulty is really low. It would be cool. I don't know. Maybe in the game, because I've only played the demo, so I'm not quite sure 
to what extent this game is, but it'd be nice if they gave you like a, a trimmer. So you could come in like a little push mower or something. That'd be a little easier. So we'll go down here and get this one. We'll go, oh, I just overloaded the engine again. The grass is really tall. All right, we'll go around here. We'll go around it once and then we'll clean it up. So we at least see what we, what we missed, right? Now there is a thing and I think it's, I think you press, you stop and you press the tab key. Or is it the F key? Uh, control? There it is. The control key will show you uh, where the grass is that you missed. Right? So it's all the grass that hasn't been cut yet. So I'm going to go back around here and then I'm just going to square all this off and get this part down here done. And then we'll get that little section there under that trellis. And then we'll just do this yard in two nice quick sections. So I'm going to ride this all the way down and square this off. Oh, just overloaded it. Got to slow down. We'll make swipes around the back here. I do have to say that the frame rate is a lot better than it was in the demo. Uh, I was having a lot of problems with my frame rate and lag because of the grass rendering. Uh, I do have a 3080, so it was interesting that I would have that problem, but I don't have it now. So they must have optimized it a little bit. And I even have the grass render distance up. So I'm kind of happy with that. The cool thing is, is that the time... Uh, is up there in the corner, so I know it's not real time, but it gives me kind of an idea how long I've been recording, which I kind of like. I don't actually waste time in the video. Like I said, I haven't recorded in almost two years, guys. I think I was recording Minecraft the last time I stopped recording. Uh, I'm not going to be doing Minecraft any longer, so if you guys want to see that, just go watch all my old videos. Um, just, you know, I still play it with my kids, but uh, I have no interest in recording it anymore. I think I'm going to stick to simulation games, so like this one. Uh, I will be doing Car Mechanic Simulator, and we might do a couple of survival games. We'll see. I'm also going to get more involved into the streaming. Uh, I own my own company now, so I have a lot of time that I can put towards... Uh, just streaming and recording in general. It's not that I'm not busy. I just have more time, more freedom, schedule-wise. So yeah, I hope that uh, turns into something cool. I'm not trying to get into it big. I just enjoyed, you know, recording videos, talking to you guys, interacting with with viewers. I thought it was cool, and I miss it. I really do. So we're gonna do this. I've been waiting for this game for a long time. I love when I watch YouTube video uh, or YouTubers and they're always like, man, I've had this game on my radar for so long. And they say that like with every single game. I really haven't had any games on my radar other than this one. Uh, I thought this was a great idea. I love Farm Simulator. Uh, I can't wait till the Farm Simulator 22 comes out. Although I am kind of disappointed in what I've seen so far. It looks like a repackage and they just kind of upgraded a couple things. Um, I know that they added seasons and some factory stuff, which we already had. So those of you that have played Farm Simulator, you probably like me and like, dude, we already had that stuff. Um, but we'll see. I mean, it looks like they've got some uh, destructible terrain. Hopefully it's, it's a lot more involved than what it was. And I hope that they start making larger maps. <laughs> I hate 2x maps. And it's hard to play a 2x map when you want to play multiplayer. There's just not enough farms for everybody to play on. It really isn't. So this is going on pretty well. We're 10 minutes through. And we're already almost 70% done with the property. So we're going to get this done in a pretty quick amount of time. Now, if I would have made that sharp turn right there, I would have probably damaged the ground. So that's why I stop at that. And then I'm going 
gonna go over here and get this little area here. I gotta watch the sides so I don't damage it. And then we'll back up and get this little edge right here. Right there. Now we did hit it. I'm fine with that. They don't charge us for that. They only charge us if I like uh, hit a tree or hit a plant or damage something like a, like a water fountain or a statue something like that so we got that little section there let's get this here and then we'll move over to the other section of the yard and we should be done with this contract i'm hoping that i can record two of them two projects this first one because the first two are actually in the demo like i said um but we'll see if we got time I'll probably be fine since I gotta fast forward the whole entire first section, or the first part of this video because you couldn't hear me. I couldn't even hear myself in the, when I went back to check it. The sound is, even though if you go into the sound settings and turn like the master volume down, everything else stays up. Like, so if, <laughs> what's the point of a master volume if everything else stays up? It's not master volume. Nope. But yeah, I, I like games like this because uh, it's just, I almost want to say it's therapeutic in a way. It's, I don't know. There's another game that I've been playing just for fun on my own, and it's the power washing game. I don't know why, but that game is just, just fun to play because, you know, you're, you accomplish something, right? They give you a task. You got to go until you, you finish it every little spot, right? So maybe we even do that. They're supposed to add a lot more items and places to power wash, so we'll see. We'll see how this video goes first. I might I might get zero views, and that's fine. So I'm hoping that we get a pretty good amount of change on this job. So far, I'm doing a lot better than I did on the on the demo. On the demo, I hit stuff, I tore down plants, I did all kinds of things that were bad. And this one, I'm doing pretty well. The other cool thing that would be interesting in this game is if you could stripe the grass. Um, and that's just, you know, you could do that by mowing it in opposite directions, or you can just pull a roller behind you. And this does look like it has like a little trailer hitch on the back. So I'm not quite sure if eventually we can get a roller. But I do know that you have to uh, maintain your tractors. Tractors. You have to maintain your low lawnmowers. Um, you can repair the blades, sharpen them, uh, add fuel. And you'll see that when we get done with this contract, when we get to the garage. Um, you can upgrade your company. Uh, the amount of bays that you have. So the amount of bays determines how many um, lawnmowers that you're allowed to have. Uh, I believe we can hire people because it looks like you, when you pick who you want to mow the properties, that would uh, lead me to, to guess that uh, that's going to be people that you can hire, so that'll be interesting. get this section here. I'm just going to go back and forth on this one. Get this little section here. So I hope you guys have been doing well. I don't know how many people are actually still on the channel that subscribed. I know I was getting a lot of subscri subscribers there when I was doing my farm sim uh, videos and that was the last time I recorded and I stopped because of various reasons. Uh, one of them happened to be uh, uh, the, uh, the pandemic, so, and I'm not going to talk about anything about the pandemic or politics or anything on this channel, so don't worry about it. And if you put stuff in there, in my comments, I'm just going to ignore it. But yeah, it uh, stopped a lot of people from 
their normal schedules. And really, since then, there hasn't been any really good games. Um, I thought about coming back and recording Valheim, uh, but that game got real boring real fast. Um, it's hard to play a, a multiplayer game in that as well. Um, I did want to record more Farming Simulator, but then we found out Farming Simulator 22 was coming out. Uh, so that kind of took the fun out of 19, because you're basically just playing something, waiting on the new one. <laughs> And you don't want to put a bunch of effort into something when you know something new is coming out. Uh, I'm trying to think of some other games that came out. Uh, but yeah, there's been a bunch of games that came out and I, I thought were interesting. And I really wanted to record them. I just... You know, a lot of times you have that feeling like this isn't going to be good to record. And yeah, I enjoy games and I could just say, you know what? You're just going to watch me play whatever I want to play and whether you like it or not. I could do that. I really could, but I'm not going to. So we're just going to start with this one, because it's a new game. To everybody, including myself. And we'll see how it goes. So we are done, but you can see that I am not done. So we're going to finish this off, because I don't want to wait. Or I don't want to leave any grass on the, on, in the property. So it looks like I'm looking around little piece here, alright, little piece there, it looks like we're good, I like it, it looks good, so let's go ahead, put the deck up, alright, and let's back in, because they want you to back in, driver. Right, let's get this in there. Boop. There we go. So there's the old Nook Cottage at the front. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? I did a great job. I did a great job. All right. So let's confirm it. Let's see how we did statistically. Statistically. All right. So we did have uh, penalties and fines of $7 and some collisions of $5. So we almost had, what's that? 12 uh, 1250 in euros. I mean, I don't know what that is in American dollars, but we made some money, which is good, right? And we got 70 experience. Awesome. Let's accept it and move on. All right. So we got some achievements down here. Cool. That's cool. Uh, so let's do, um, let's see, advertisements, edit company, edit player. Let's go to the garage and then maintenance, repair, uh, full repair. That cost me like a couple cents. And this is going to cost me like $3. Two dollars and two dollars. We'll just call it dollars, right? I don't think that you can change it to dollars. Can you change it to dollars? Let's go to options. Uh, they got linked units, but they don't have monetary units. Interesting. Interesting. All right. Well, that's fine. If you guys could do that, if you're watching developers. Uh, so our next job is the Kingsbury House. It's value right there, uh, $345, so we might make a little bit more than that. Uh, I don't think we can buy a garage yet. What is purchase headquarters? How much is it? It's $150,000. <laughs> no, we cannot. All right, well, let's just, let's do this one first then. <laughs> All right, let's do this one real quick. Uh, it's going to be us, my lawnmower, 99.5%. Uh, we want to do a 2 and 3 eighths, 2 and 3 quarters. And we got about the same amount of time. So we're gonna say, okay, all right, so let's start. Same process, we're gonna run around the edges. All right, pretty yard. I like it, all right, that's enough. All right, so as you can see, this, did, this is the exact same thing it did in the demo and I kept asking about it. Your Y axis resets. I cannot stand that, guys, seriously, fix this. See, it's, it resets when you're off of the... So when I get back on my lawnmower, I gotta fix it again. It's so dumb. It's so dumb. Why would you reset it? Why would you want it to be different when you're on the lawnmower? I'm not playing with a joystick. All right, let's go around the property here real fast. We're looking at the ground. YouTube compression's probably gonna screw this all up. It's gonna look like crap. 
All right, let's go over here. Oh, there's something there. Oh, there's something there. We got one more item to find. Okay, let's check like over here in the middle. Oh my god, I didn't see anything. All right, let's go back this way. I'm literally not seeing it because I'm blind. We have two minutes to find it. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh my god, seriously? Oh, they hit it. They hit it well. They hit it really well. Unless I'm just running too fast. I'm running so fast that it doesn't show up. Is it in the flower bed or something? I mean, for real. Like, where is it? Did you guys see it? Did you see it? Oh my god. Are we gonna not get it? Oh, there it is. Awesome. The shovel. <whistles> Minute 56. We almost didn't get it. Almost didn't get it. All right, let's get in our trailer tractor. Or lawnmower. I don't know why I keep calling it tractor. All right, let's turn the engine on. Throttle it up. Uh, cut height's already set. Walk forward. See, now my, now my camera's messed up. So I gotta go back in here. Switch this back. Now we're good. All right. So we're gonna press uh, the Q button. All right, and hold the Z button again. Engaged. Engaged. All right, so now we're gonna run around the perimeter. This one's got a fairly deep uh, flower bed. I like this. Uh, how far the flowers are from the edge. I like that a lot. I don't remember if it was like that in the demo. It probably was. We'll go around these probes. Oh, I don't know why I keep hearing cows. Are they trolling us? So we'll go around this perimeter. I might fast forward through this one because you guys uh, kind of know the, the ropes of it, but I'll we'll do the perimeter and we'll do the trim out so we can at least see what the property looks like. Right. Uh, there's a nice straight line right here. I like straight lines. be cool if it had like a GPS system. <laughs> Something that you could just click and it goes straight. So you don't have to, because it's kind of hard to steer on here. Like keep it, like it kind of like goes with the grade. So if the grade falls to one side, your tractor kind of wants to go with it. Let's so go up here. And then we're going to back up. And we're going to go back the other way. And this is what I did on the last one, but I was uh, interrupted by the enormous volume that the game has. So we're going to go around the perimeter again, and then we'll hit up the islands. Stuff in the middle. we got to watch our engine over there. Make sure we don't get up there to that red line. Okay, I'm going to try to cut these loops out of here, or these little um, bump parts to try to square it off a little bit. Help us out. Curve this and keep this nice and straight. I might just do loops around this section. It would be easier. This is a fairly straight part over here. There's a little bit of grass here on that hill. Get that back up. Let's get back in our our groove here. I'm gonna take this straight across and then we're gonna clean this section up here right real quick. Get that section and then that section. And that 
section. <laughs> Alright, cool. Alright, let's turn around. Get that straightened out there. And then let's go down here real quick. And then we'll get the sidewalks. And then I'll probably throw on a little fast forward motion for us. And maybe even some cool music if you're lucky. I don't know. We'll see when I edit it. I might just do it in complete silence. Because that's cool. It's very awkward, but it's cool, right? Alright, so we don't want to hit anything here, that's for sure. Like that plant. Trim out the sidewalk. And then we'll go up the other side. Get that sidewalk. Now in the demo, I kept getting docked for making turns on the sidewalk. It said I damaged the ground, but I mean I guess it could be gravel. I don't know. I thought it was like concrete. Maybe not. It's not. I do like just trimming it. It looks kind of cool if you just trim it and leave the grass. Like, we could just leave now. Say, you know, there you go, buddy. Like that guy on TikTok. All right, Dan. Let's see, I just damaged the ground. Now, where did I damage the ground at? Right here. Like, I didn't make a sharp turn. Whatever. All right, guys. I am going to mow this section, and uh, I'll bring you all back. All right, guys, we are back, and I just, see, I swear to God, yeah, we damaged the ground. As soon as I come back, I did, I did fine the whole time that we were recording, the whole time. But anyways, I was going to say, like, I noticed something uh, in the game, and it has to do with, I don't know if it's a collision, um, but every once in a while, you'll see, like, the tractor will kind of, like, jog to the side, and if you guys are playing along... Uh, let me know if you have this too, but it feels like there's like a collision going on. Like a graphic collision, like maybe they got something that's got a bigger hitbox than it needs to be. Um, but every once in a while when you go around these, these like little island parts, it wants to kick you to the side a little bit. And I thought that it was just like latency, but it's not. Um, I have a FPS counter up there and a latency counter and I'm fine, so... I think it's just a graphic uh, something in the in the map that's causing it. I'm not quite sure, but we are pretty much done here. I'm gonna clean up this little area right here, and then we should be good. I know that I damaged the ground a few times. I don't think we hit any flowers on this one. Um, I don't even realize. I mean, understand how we damaged the ground. We didn't do anything. Unless uh, the motor, like, I know that there's terrain on here, as you can see, like there's hills and stuff, so maybe our deck hit the ground. But we do have our deck at the highest that they wanted it, so it's not like I'm grinding the ground. Like if we went into a low spot. So, yard looks good. I'm going to lift the deck here. We'll go park this bad boy on our trailer, and this was our second one. We finished about five minutes ahead of time, so it took a little bit longer than I thought. But that's good. At least we got done on time. Let's back this bad boy up. And this is another job well done. All right, so you can see that we got pretty much everywhere. I did leave a couple little tiny spots. There's a spot there on the left, and I think there's a spot up here by the gazebo. But other than that, we did pretty well. I like that one. It was fun. So let's see how we did, statistically again. Uh, actually, we didn't do that bad. We only lost, what, 50 cents for penalties. Um, 25 cents for collisions and 26 cents for ground damage. So we didn't do that bad. So we actually, the value of the job was 325. We made 356. So we made, you know, $21. That's not bad. Pretty good. All right, let's click accept. And we just became a newcomer rank two. Yes. Awesome. Amateur challenge accept. All right. Well, that's going to be it for this episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. It's good to be back. Uh, if you're new to the channel, 
or uh, you just enjoy what you're seeing, click the like button and hit that subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. And also hit the little bell beside the subscription um, that lets you know that I have uploaded a video and it's time for you to come and watch. So that's your job, all right? So do it. Um, but yeah, guys, I'll see you next episode. Uh, this has been Lawn Simulator.